Okay, here's the actuator. It sits on the ball valve. And up here's the controller. As you notice, it doesn't require power. It's got, both of them got batteries in them. Okay. I say we're going to come over here. And this is the sensor I'm going to put at the washer and dryer area. If it sees water anywhere on this cable, it will close the valve. You can also add on extension to it. So I'm going to take and I'm going to put a drop of water on there. And it would have flashed red. And over here you can see it's closing the ball valve. It takes about 20 seconds to close it. Alright, so once it closes, you got to clear the fault. So the only way to clear this one is it's got to dry out. So I'm going to unplug it here. That way we won't have a fault. Then I'm going to come back over. So when it when it closes, you either have to push this button right here, and that'll manually open it, or you need to go on the app, and you can uh, can open it. Air is fully open. Now we come back over here. And this sensor here, those two probes, or you got two sets on the bottom. And all it has to do is water has to um, bridge across those two points there. So I'm going to put a drop of water. You see that red light flash? And we come back over here. We'll see the ball valve going close. Pretty neat, huh? So this guy here, see how he's flashing red? So once I clear, once I clear that, won't flash red. And I can come back over here and I can open the ball valve. See how it's closed. So there's a button right on the underneath side here. Push that one time. And it'll open up. These sensors here run about $17 each. This type here is a little bit more expensive, $25. This is a more robust um, actuator they have. It runs about $400 and it comes with three of the sensors, three of the water sensors. And it, they have all kinds of water sensors. They got them that you can put on the door you can put them on your mailbox to tell when the mail's coming. You can, um, I've got one that's um, in my freezer that tells me if the temperature's getting up in my freezer. That's what I really like. I like that one. So, hope you enjoy. Bye.